A new officer on the police force in the city of New Haven for the first time in the department's history, K-9 Finn, Officer Finn, <laughs> will serve as a comfort dog for officers and for the surrounding community. Joining us now is Officer Finn and Officer Patricia Lamb. Thank you so much for taking the Thank time. Thank you for having us. I know, Finn, this is, uh, it may not look like he's working, but comforting people is exactly what he is on the force to do. So yes. walk us through how you and Finn met, uh, how you guys got connected, and how special your bond is. So the police department was looking for an organization to, um, to get a service dog, and then um, we found Forever in My Heart Foundation, and they were able to provide us with Finn. Um, so I met Finn in October of last year, and that's when we began our training, and here we are now. And he goes home with you. He is your dog. Yes, he is. Oh, and how has is, how is this first week been? I know. Oh, I love it. We, we've been loving it, um, having him home. Now, you had mentioned that Finn has already been up and in the community. Yes. He went to a carnival yesterday, which is why he's probably yes. so wiped out today. And, and he did so well. The kids loved him. Um, everyone just wanted to approach him. And, and so for people that don't know, what is the role of a comfort dog? Because it may just look like, you know, they're laying around, they're doing things, but they're all this is this is work to them right right um so for example i get really anxious sometimes and he's there to relieve some of that anxiety um to make me feel comfortable um and, and <laughs> confident in myself um so finn helps with releasing stress um anxiety um and, and things like that. And I think in the world that we live in today, you know, a lot of people are under a lot of pressure, yes. a lot of anxiety. Good and boy, and yeah. as a police officer, you deal with these grueling, stressful situations on a regular basis. Is his role also going to incorporate the community as well? He will then be able to comfort others besides besides you as yes, well. Yes, yes. So exactly. That's one of our, um, our goals is to be out in the community with Officer Finn, um, especially after a traumatic, a traumatic event in the community, um, Officer Finn and we'll be out there possibly the next day. Um, you know, just reaching out to the community. Oh, yes, we love a good belly good rub. Boy. We love a good, good belly boy, rub. What do we can have? Oh, like, he loves boy. it. <laughs> he has done so great this, yes, this first has. week. But it is a lot of pressure. And, and I think with that comes, you know, the need for a comfort dog to be in all of these departments, especially in a city like New Haven where there is a lot going on. Uh, what is your favorite part? Uh, just everything about Finn. Honestly, just everything about him. Um, at home, he follows me around. Uh, <laughs> and I love it. I, I just love it. We love going to the park and just playing, spending time together. Meeting at first, in love at first sight. <laughs> Finn, you are going to do great things in the city of New Haven. We are so looking yes, forward to checking is. in with you. Maybe we'll do a six-month check-in of how the job is going. Oh, yes. We'll like that. I'm going to put it on our calendar now. <laughs> it is going to be very exciting. Congratulations Thank as you well. So much. This is a huge deal, and yes, Finn, we are so excited to welcome you to the Fox 61 headquarters over here. We're, we're excited to see him out in the <laughs> Thank community. Thank you so much for having me.